I just went on a two day staycation. This is what I came home to. Welcome back everyone. Today's video is going to be a new PR haul and unboxing. So I'm super excited to do this. I try to do these PR hauls on a pretty consistent basis now, every week, every other week. I do ask for audience participation in these videos. Let me know out of everything that I have hauled, what you wanna see in my next first impression video. So I just always go through the comments and I see what you guys are saying and what you really wanna see in my next videos. So I was actually just doing a little staycation. I probably have a get ready with me up that I did from the Bellagio. And I had a bunch of packages when I came home. So we are going to be doing a PR haul today. And the first package I grabbed is actually something that is not yet released. So can't show that. That is like the tricky thing with doing these PR hauls. Cause I actually, I just went down to check my mailbox again today and I had a box in there from a brand that I was like, pretty sure I can't talk about this one yet either. So try to be aware that I don't put anything in my videos that hasn't already been announced um but let's see this is from ofra cosmetics this is their head in the clouds this is available june 12th i think today's like the 20th or something that i'm feeling crazy i think it's the, is it the first day of summer might be the first day of summer okay then so this is from ofra the head in the clouds mini mix face palette Ooh, so it looks like we have some highlighters in here and also some blushes so here is what the palette is looking like so very vibrant blushes i feel like those are really good for the summer and then also three highlighters on top here so we have a new face palette from ofra i do have a discount code with them which is samantha this is uh, available for 42 dollars next up this package so this from rare beauty and i was like what when i saw this because um the rare beauty pr and this was addressed to my old apartment and i don't know why it got put into my new because we have like a locker system where i live and i moved apartments um last september within the complex and so all of my rare beauty packages have been lost in the fold so i don't know if someone i've told the office a million times but no one cares. And I was like, there's probably packages for me in these lockers, like if you want to like open them so I can take the packages out. But I don't know, for some reason this one made it through. So let's see what we have in here. Meet the newest shade in the Kind Words collection, Devoted, a true red that flatters all skin tones. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? We have like this little makeup bag and is this a claw clip I see? I do love me a good claw clip. Oh, little claw clip from rare beauty and then also inside we have a lip liner and then a lipstick oh i'm so excited because i really do like the rare beauty lip products um oh i have another red lip liner from them so again this is devoted but to me it's um it's not this like true red like this and i've been trying to wear more red lips this year i've been talking recently about the charlotte tilbury hollywood vixen i just did like my sephora reviews i also did mid-year favorites that should already be up by now and i talk about that red lipstick so i don't know maybe should we do a comparison of these two reds Ooh, look at that that this reminds me of hollywood vixen and they're both a matte finish formula Ooh, that's pretty Oh, I will be doing a lip combo video ASAP with this one. Oh, I'm so glad that somehow made it through. Next up, I'm not sure who this package is from. Okay, this is from YSL. This is their new All Hours Hyper Bronzer. I have been waiting for this bronzer for so long. Like, I feel like we filled out the survey of if we want it. YSL, I think, is really good at i um, sending out like hey like this is the next thing that we're sending out do you want it or not and you can opt in and when i saw a bronzer i was like please for the love of please send it to me and then we kept getting emails like sorry it's been delayed sorry it's been delayed i'm like where is this bronzer i feel like i haven't tried a new bronzer in so long wow this is fancy wow okay oh that's beautiful look at this that is so pretty are you joking me I'm sorry, are you joking? I cannot wait to use this. This will definitely be in my next first impressions. I don't even care. Beautiful, I love it. I'm so, I, can, I feel like I haven't tried a new bronzer in a hot minute. And I have been really looking forward to trying that one from YSL. Next up, we have a package from Koki Cosmetics. Let's see. This looks like we have brow pencils maybe? Yeah, brow down. 
We don't settle when it comes to perfect brows. Our micro fine eyebrow pencil delivers super precise pigment. Listen, again, been doing, um, like I did mid-year favorites, I talked about the CoverGirl brow pencils and how much I love them. So I'm excited to try out some more affordable brow products and see what we think. These are Koki. Okay, they feel very lightweight, but they look kind of more bougie. Okay, so we have auburn, black, chocolate brown, dark brown, and blonde. Uh, I don't know which one I would be. Chocolate brown, maybe? I don't know if that seems right. I was thinking, usually I feel like a lot of times my shade is like soft brown. So I'm not really sure why each one is freaking wrapped in this plastic like this. I'm <sighs> don't really love that, but we'll see what they look like here. Okay, so you got spoolie on one side, got a pretty small pencil on the other. Again, this is the chocolate brown. I don't know, this, I don't know if that'll be too dark for my brows, but I definitely want to try these out. I, I enjoy trying out brow products. I keep thinking, my friend Katie just got her brows done the other day, and I was like, Ugh. like, should I be getting my brows done? But I don't know, I kind of like trying out brow products. Next up I have a package from Volition Beauty. I want to say, I know they emailed me. I want to say maybe it was like a sunscreen that they were coming out with. And I was like, sunscreen? Sign me up. So this is their Prismatic Luminizing Shield SPF 50 Broad Spectrum Sunscreen with Niacinamide and Hyaluronic Acid. Both ingredients that I really enjoy. I'll be adding this to my sunscreen pile and giving this a try. This looks kind of fancy too. Just do like a little, oh, okay. It's very liquidy. I possibly should have shook that up a little bit, but here is the sunscreen. It looks like it's gonna be more of like a glowy finish type of sunscreen. Okay. Again, I like niacinamide. I like hyaluronic acid. So I will definitely be trying this one out from Volition. I'll have anything that I can uh, linked in my description box and also in the YouTube shopping button as always. Next up, we have a package from Skin Fix. I'm trying to go quick. I, I'm not going to the airport today. I feel like the last few hauls I've been like getting ready to go traveling, but I do have two events. I have back-to-back -back events tonight. I need to get ready for that and then I need to drive on one side of town and then I need to drive down to the strip. So it's gonna be an interesting night, but I'm only home for a week. So I wanna try to make as many events as I can in Las Vegas. So this is from Skin Fix, their Barrier Plus Ceramide and Ectoin. No way I'm saying that right. Gentle Gel Cleanser. I do love a good cleanser. Targets dry, dehydrated skin, dull looking skin. It's also makeup and SPF remo remover. Oh, okay. Well, I'll give this a shot. Tested and recommended by Unbiased Derms is what it says on here. I love that. Barrier Restorative Gel to Foam Wash. I would definitely give this a try. I like a lot from Skin Fix. I like some of their moisturizers. Uh, I would definitely throw this into my rotation for makeup remover and cleanser. So this one does not say who it is from either. Oh, this is another one from YSL. YSL All Hours Hyper Finish Powder? Soft Matte Powder. Wait, I'm like, do I remember this one? I thought they sent me two bronzers, but it looks like this one is gonna be a powder. Okay, YSL Beauty, coming out with all the products. This is the Ultimate On The Go Couture Powder. This 24 hour soft matte powder sweeps away shine and sets foundation, ensuring your makeup stays flawless all day long. Once again, very bougie packaging. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I definitely wanna try this with the bronzer. So this is like more of a white powder. I mean, I'm sure it's supposed to be translucent, but powered by skincare actives, including hyaluronic, hyaluronic acid and niacinamide. Okay, this non-comedogenic and sweat resistant formula delivers softer, blurred looking skin with extended makeup wear. I'm gonna give it a try. Listen, listen to what I saw. I'm gonna give you a try, boo. Next up, looks like this package is from Clarence. So from Clarence, we have skincare next level sun protection. Formulate it with our plant-based sun filter complex to help block out damaging UVA, UVB rays. Defense against visible effects of photo aging supports firmness and elasticity. So we have two products here from Clarence. We have the Broad Spectrum SPF 50 Dry Touch Facial Sunscreen. And then we also have, ooh, sunscreen body lotion spray. I am intrigued, Clarence. 
I am intrigued to try this. Body lotion spray. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Well, listen, I love SPF. I walk outside every single day. I love being outside. Love my SPF. So I'm very excited to try this. I'm really curious about the spray one. Okay. Moving along, we have one from Benefit Cosmetics. Alrighty. From Benefit, looks like we have a box of goodies in here. Benefit Wanted Hot Summer Roundup. Hey, y'all. We've lassoed with the most wanted bestsellers for your hottest summer yet, and we're just getting started. Now get ready for the chance to win a 2024 pink Ford Bronco. What? And when you shop $65 worth of Benefit products at Ulta. Well, there you go, y'all. I think that's for everybody. So some of their bestsellers, the Professional Super, Sp Super Setter Spray, <laughs> one of my favorites, the Professional Primer, the Benetint, the Bad Girl Bang Mascara, the 24-Hour Brow Setter, the Hula Matte Bronzer. There's also, oh, the Benefit Precisely My Brow, one of my favorites. And the new Do La La Liquid Glow, which I'm assuming is this because I don't feel like I've seen this. The new Do La La Liquid Glow. They sent me tan deep. I don't, that's cute. Packaging. Benefit. Okay. Is this just like a liquid? Mine says tan deep. I'm not sure. I'm not sure that was meant to go to me. I'm not sure if this is like supposed to be just like a liquid highlighter or kind of like like dew drop, oh, like bronze drops. Like the First Aid Beauty, I just reviewed those recently. Like am I supposed to put this all over my face as like bronze and glow drops? I'm not really sure. So I feel like maybe tan deep wouldn't be that bad of a shade match for me, but okay. If you wanna see me give this a try, I'll maybe look into it a little closer <laughs> of how this is supposed to work, but Thank you, Benefit, for sending over some bestsellers. And if you want to win a pink Ford Bronco, do some shopping at Ulta. Next we have, oh, this is from Aversio Wellness. Oh, woohoo. Um, so Aversio Wellness, I actually just mentioned them in your favorites, yeah, um, the follower favorites video that I did where I took all of the um, products that you purchased during my affiliate links in the month of May. I compiled them all into the top 10 purchases that you made. And I mentioned in there, um, a Versio Wellness and the functional mushrooms like lion's mane, reishi, cordyceps, and it was actually um, reishi that was a top seller in May, which helps like promote sleep and relaxation. Nice like ASMR. Me some Energize Now, which is the cordyceps. So this is what I like to take like right now, like in the afternoon when I'm starting to get a little bit tired instead of caffeine, I do cordyceps. And then also the four mushroom blend. Um, this used to be called the balance blend, I'm pretty sure. So this has lion's mane, mataki, reishi, and shiitake. And then the, this is my one of my absolute favorites. This is the three mushroom blend. This is turkey tail, cordyceps, and lion's mane. I had this in my tea this morning. I typically, my first tea of the day, this is what I always, I usually have one in the morning and one at night. I typically put um, the three mushroom blend in there because lion's mane really, really helps me a lot with my focus and concentration and all of those things. I like to do sometimes at night with my tea, I'll do either the four mushroom blend or the one, the rejuvenate blend. Um, and then again, like I mentioned with the cordyceps, that's what I like to use if I feel like I need a little bit more energy and I don't want to go the caffeine route. So yay, so excited about that. I do have a discount code with Aversio Wellness, which is Samantha. If there's anything that you're interested in checking out or if you want to look into the research of functional mushrooms and the different ones that they have, the different blends that they have and any that could benefit you. I will have them linked. And then next up, this one is from the Inky List. Okay. So from the Inky List, they are a skincare brand. Let's see. This says, patch it, clear it fast. Think you know pimple patches, think again. Inky is taking them to the next level. Bringing you a better, faster way to beat that breakout. Clinically proven to visibly reduce breakouts in just four hours. Our new hyaluronic pimple patches cover and visibly clear at a rapid speed. Listen, I can put these to the test, okay? I can. Designed with our exclusive Invisiblur technology that patches are both ultra thin and ultra matte, making them appear undetectable on all skin tones, even under makeup. To maximize your results, always apply to cleanse dry skin. We re recommend using our ultimate, oh my God, <laughs> clearing cleanser salicylic acid. Okay, that was way too difficult to get out. Fast acting, you'll wonder if it actually happened. It's so invisible, you will forget that you even put it on. Well, I'm very curious about this. I recently had a really bad reaction 
to an SPF that I tried that had watermelon in it. I think I'm sensitive or allergic to watermelon, but I gave it a try anyways, and then my entire face broke out. I do struggle with hormonal acne and things like that, but I mean, I was breaking out in my eyebrows, on my lips, my forehead, literally everywhere. Even my neck, because I would bring sunscreen down into my neck, I was getting breakouts on my neck as well. I was like, okay. So um, we're still in the process of healing, but I am definitely gonna be using these pimple patches. And if they say four hours, like you betcha that I'm gonna be doing a little video on that. I have tried their salicylic acid cleanser in the past and it is nice. Again, for those times where I feel like I'm especially struggling, using something like a salicylic acid is helpful. Uh, so yeah, we will definitely be trying those out. I am very intrigued, Pinky List. Next up, we have a package from Nomad Cosmetic. So this is one of their new travel palettes. It says, greetings from the Florida Keys. So this is the new Keys Beachy and Peachy Intense Color Palette. The destination, the southernmost point in the continental US, Florida Keys is a tropical paradise with a laid back, come as you feel look. So we have a collection of tropical hues from sun-washed yellows, peaches, and key limes to richly soaked purples and blues and sunset crawls. There's 11 fun in the sun mattes and seven glistening on water shimmers inspired by the always sunny Florida Keys. That comes out with the cutest travel palettes. In my last haul, I had like these little mini ones and i still do want to try those i just the natasha been on a golden palette that came out so that's what i was using this looks so fun and colorful look how cute this is this definitely to me is like a florida palette i don't know if i would necessarily say it's my perfect color story because i'm more of a neutral bay but um we have some greens in here that are pretty some yellow some of these shimmers look fun let me know we don't have a lot of eyeshadow palettes in this haul but Again, I had some from Nomad in the last haul. Would you wanna see those palettes, like the mini ones? Would you wanna see a bigger one in my next first impressions? Please do let me know. I do have a discount code with Nomad, and that is Samantha. Next up, I do have an outfit that I purchased myself. So I'm going to the Hamptons in one week, and I'm not really sure what to wear. I don't feel like my closet really screams um, the Hamptons. So I was doing a little bit of searching, and I found this like cute set, what I think is cute anyways. So it's just these like, loose kind of like linen shorts and then we have this top as well i'm gonna do a try on clip and we will see how it goes let me know if you think i should wear this in the hamptons even though today i looked at the weather and we get there next friday friday looks to be like 80 degrees but then saturday the high was 69 and i was like i'm sorry what like i'm afraid like it's 110 in las vegas i was like what is this so we planned a beach day and I texted my girlfriend that's going with me. I was like, um, we're gonna have to go to the beach on Friday for sure because this is crazy. Um, but again, just kind of like a loose flowy set, you know, I'll wear like a bodysuit underneath or something along those lines. And it did come with like um, the belt. Is this for the shorts or for the top? I think maybe it's for the shorts. I see like some belt loops through there, but people told me like beige and nude and neutral colors, so. That's what I am attempting to do for my Hamptons OOTDs. I also have a girlfriend who is a stylist and she like really hooked me up when I went to Barbados. She literally brought an entire bag over for me. And then um, I think she's gonna do the same for the Hamptons. So I'm trying not to freak out too much. Ooh, trying not to freak out too much, but we'll see. We got a package from Charlotte Tilbury. This is a new product. It's a ring light in a stick, it says. Unreal Skin Sheer Glow Tint Hydrating Foundation Stick. How did I, I haven't even heard of this. The ultimate no foundation foundation. Huh? I feel like I haven't seen, is this new? Can I be talking about this? I don't even know, if, can I talk about this? Is this out? Light Mapping Mesh Tech. Easy glide and blend texture with a second skin finish, clinically proven to strengthen your skin barrier and non-communogenic. 20 stretchable shades blend seamlessly into the skin you use different shades to brighten your bronze. Charlotte's Ultimate No Foundation Foundation. What in the heck? Okay, 15 second application. Uh, I had no idea. Wow. Okay. Thanks, Shar Shar. Girl, you didn't even share this with me on our last Zoom call. Um, okay, this is the shade 5 Medium. I don't know if you can see that best. That looks like it's gonna like perfectly match my skin. I think I did five medium and some of her other foundation shades. Wow, it feels very serum -y. Okay, so I love the Anastasia Beauty Balm. Again, just filmed my mid-year favorites and I mentioned the Beauty Balm in there. So I wonder if it's gonna be similar to this. I mean, I feel like I'm definitely gonna put this in my next first impressions video. Let me know what we're thinking. 
She also sent three fair, which I don't think is really going to work for me. So I'm gonna do five medium, but I truly, I didn't even know that this was coming out. I haven't seen anything about this yet. I'm shook, but I'm so excited. And then finally we just have one last package and it's quite heavy. I wonder what is in here. It is plan, hmm. hold on, still not sure. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, chlorophyll water. I did have a brand reach out to me and ask if um, if they could send me this and I was just kind of curious about it because I've seen people use this on the internet. Oh my goodness. I to make things so hard to open. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Chlorophyll water, enhanced mountain spring water with vitamins, oxygen, energy, detox, antioxidant. So I see people do like the chlorophyll drops in the water and I'm just curious about it. I just got these, so I haven't tried them yet. Again, if you want to, you can look up, you know, the benefits of it and all of that. I'll have a link to these, I'm sure, in my description box. So the ingredients, spring water, natural plant ex extractives, chlorophyll, organic lemon juice, spearmint, vitamin A, vitamin D, and vitamin B12. Listen, for like when I'm out walking in 110 degrees, like I could bring one of these. So they sent me like a case of the core. I'm excited, I'll give these a try. Wait, should we try one right now together? Let's just give it like a taste test. I mean, it's not cold, but we can give it a little taste test. Cheers. I don't know why that scared me. I can definitely taste and I can smell spearmint. It doesn't taste like I'm drinking like toothpaste by any means, but I don't know, it's kind of got that like minty, minty freshness to it if you don't mind that in your water. I'll drink it. I'll drink this before I go. I got two events. Maybe it will just give me energy. <laughs> yes, energy. Okay, this will give me energy. Um, so I'll drink that before I go to my events tonight, but curious to try it. I'll let you know what I think and uh, how I like it. But that is everything for this PR haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I feel like there's some really fun stuff. Like I'm excited for the YSL products. I'm excited for the Charlotte Tilbury. I'm excited for the water. Got a new cleanser, those, the Inky List um patches i'm very curious about we got some sunscreen in here brow pro this was a fun haul let me know what you want to see in my next first impressions video i hope that you've been enjoying these hauls from my floor i'll see you in the next one